Hi everyone, it's Paul from This Design That. I've been using my CNC quite a lot over the last month or so, and I'm using just a normal household vacuum to suck up all of the wood dust. You can see that it gets clogged up pretty quickly. So today I'm gonna make a dust cyclone, which should really help with separating the dust and the wood chips into a bucket before it gets into the vacuum and clogs up the filters. I got a dust cyclone from Amazon, they're about 15 pound, and I bought a bucket with a sealable lid for about 10 pounds, and that's pretty much all you need. I'm just using a little bit of rubber for a gasket, which should just create a nice seal between the lid and the dust cyclone. So this thing works amazingly well. You can see the amount of wood dust that I had in my vacuum cleaner to start off with. And now I'm just gonna suck all of that back up and you can see that basically none of it actually reached the vacuum cleaner. Now, if you are using a household vacuum cleaner like me to collect your wood dust, be aware that the filters on normal vacuum cleaners are nowhere near good enough to be capturing all of that harmful wood dust. Vacuum cleaners do have an exhaust, as you can see here, and that exhaust is pumping out really fine particles of wood dust. So it's really important that you are doing it in a well-ventilated area, and preferably you're wearing a mask. I always wear a mask when I'm doing any cutting with wood, and even after a number of hours, whenever I go back into that room that I was cutting, I still wear the mask because dust particles can be airborne for quite a few hours afterwards. So make sure that you are ventilating that space even after you finish cutting. So if you can use a dedicated dust extractor, one that is rated for the material that you are using. I'm hopefully gonna be getting one myself soon, but I just wanted to make people aware that this dust cyclone doesn't just magically cut out that harmful dust from cutting wood. If you've got any questions, please feel free to ask. Remember to like and subscribe and I'll catch you later.